Yeah, we're baby proofing. In this episode, I'm going to be baby proofing the cabinets and drawers in my kitchen here as required whenever you have a child, but also from the foster agency directly. They need to make sure that things like knives and sharp objects, chemicals under the sink are baby proof so the child cannot get into them and get hurt. I'm using these latches to do that. Let's get started. When you have kids, you wanna make sure that you protect them from chemicals, sharp knives, objects, things like this. Kids are curious little creatures. We all know that. And you gotta make sure you're protecting them. Something that the foster agency requires us to do here in Los Angeles is make sure that every drawer that we have with sharp objects and chemicals and things like that are protected and locked so kids cannot get in. I started this process already on the drawers and I'm not the biggest fan of these. I think that while they are very easy to attach to the drawers and the cabinets, um, they come off and they break. So if you use any real amount of force, they come off. I'm actually gonna head over to CVS and I'm going to purchase some super glue. So these latches that I purchased are, they connect to your drawers or your cabinets through these 3M sticky little, I don't know, sticky sticks, whatever you wanna call them, pads. And you put this on your drawer and you put this little latch at the top and it's supposed to catch like that. Well, this isn't really that sticky. I mean, I attached a few of them and they came right off. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go buy some super glue, super glue this side to the drawer, super glue this side to the top. And that way when it actually catches or however it goes on actually catches, it'll actually catch. And if you use any real force, it won't come off. All right, so I'm going to knock out two birds with one stone and take this guy. Where are you at, Lake? Lake. <laughs> Take this guy with me to go to CVS. We're gonna go on a walk. Here's VR. Yeah, let's go. All right, we did it, we went to CVS, we got some super glue to add to, our, to these. These, okay, like they are easy, get out of here. They are easy to put on. However, they don't, like you can easily pull them off. So if you've got this sucker like this, this is supposed, supposed to go like here. This is a sticky peel. Okay, see how that comes off? And then when you close it, it's gonna go whoosh, whoosh, like that and it catches there. And when to open the drawer or the cabinet, once you open it, you just press this down like that and then it lets it go out. So you would, you would do your like slight open, then you'd press down and then you can open all the way. Let's get started.
there you have it. That was me attaching these latches to the doors. I have super glue all over my fingers. If you have any advice how to get super glue off of your skin, I think vinegar or alcohol, something like that, please uh, comment in the description below. But here's my thoughts on these latches. I got these off of Amazon because who doesn't love Amazon? Um, if you do not use something like super glue to really keep these suckers attached to the, um, the drawers or the cabinets, whatever you're affixing it to, then they're gonna come off. The 3M sticker just is not strong enough to hold you, you know, accidentally forgetting that there was a lock on there and it will come off. So I've got the super glue on it and it is pretty strong. Other than that, that's it for today. Thanks for watching this video. I'm gonna do another episode probably in the next couple of days about the home study process um, that I just went through this week. So I did have my second home study meeting and it was pretty, pretty intense. It had a lot of conversation about my past and family and stuff that I've been through in my life. And we'll get more into that in the next video. So make sure that you guys have subscribed. Make sure you click that like button and then also hit the bell icon so you can be aware of when I do have that video coming out. It's gonna be in the next day or two. I'm excited to share that with you guys. But till next time, I think that's about it. Thanks for watching. Bye.